Mr. and Mrs. Shore are both lovely human beings, and he said, uh, Scott, can you meet me over at Coffee Bean? And I'm like, sure, Mark, I'll, I'll meet you over at Coffee Bean. And he sat down and said, I'm going to build a house in the summit. And, uh, and he grabbed me by the hand, he pulled me forward, and he goes, you're building. What puts Forte in a league all of its own is, is our vertical integration. We sell perform seven of the trades in-house. We have over 175 employees. And so from specialty metals, framing, drywall, tape, and paint, all that's controlled in-house. We direct import all of our stone materials. So it's really about controlling the supply chain. And we're able to frame a you know cold form steel. We form all our own stuff, so we're not cutting any material on site. As we're doing the underground and the plumbing and electrical rough in, we're actually putting together the framing of your home in another warehouse. We're able to show up when the slab is bored and erect your home, install your windows, and dry in the home so you're not exposed to weather and rot and all, all the other things that come along with twisting of wood. So being a, a metal builder the way we are, it just gives you a more, you know, more a, a better product at the end of the day. It's not just exposed to the elements. The partnership among Scott Acton, Luke Jackson, and myself is, to me, is a beautiful alignment. It's, I think it's a great um, balance of, of skills. We're not, we're not afraid to, uh, to, to venture and consider ways that, uh, that finance has an impact on the business. What our client wants is important. It's something that they have thought about. They're big decisions that our clients have made. Uh, in many cases, it's emotional decisions. They're not just practical decisions. These are emotional decisions, and I think that we understand that. That uh, you know, what our client, uh, the process that they went through, uh, was not an easy one, and so you know, we're we're vested in trying to get them where they want to be. When he started telling me about this vertically integrated approach to the company, something kind of struck in my mind. And I told him right then and there, I was like, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna quit my job and I'm gonna come work with you and do this. And he said, he laughed, he was like, well, I don't have any backlog. I don't have anything for you to do. And I said, I don't care, I'm, I'm all in. I cashed in my 401k, I put in my two week notice. So we started out with, with no backlog, no projects, and we just literally, we were in our kitchens and we built it from, from the ground up. The integration um, of, our, of our services that we offer to our customers, they, they come to us because we have a reputation for building fast, uh, doing what we say we're going to do, and delivering a quality product. There's experts in CAD and architecture, drafting, design, engineering, fabrication. It's literally a village of people it takes to build a place like this. It's not, it's not just one project manager or one person. It's all of us together that make it work. I love the design process. I love new projects and kicking things off and concepting what it will be, what it could be, how are we going to do it, what's it going to take to do it. There just is no can't. I don't know how to explain that. It's, it's, you can say I'm having difficulty. You can say this is hard. You can say that I'm not sure we're going to find a way. But I just don't use that word for any reason. There's always a way.